Name your feelings. Pushing yourself to identify and name your feelings is an important part of getting grounded. In Chapter 2, you are asked to become familiar with dozens of different feeling states that contribute to overall experiences of anger, contentment, or insecurity. Doctors Matthew Lieberman and Naomi Eisenberger have demonstrated how helpful that exercise can be in a moment of emotional intensity. When research subjects were asked to label the feeling that best fit a series of powerful images, their efforts to concentrate on selecting the best description immediately diminished the activity in the amygdala and related regions. As the thinking parts of the brain connect to your emotional response, you will be better able to move beyond that first impulse to either implode or explode. 